Laquery today. I still don't know if I'm pronouncing it right. Um, am I, I'm saying it right, right? Query. Is it Quarry? Quarry? Quarry. English is hard. I haven't played it yet. I haven't played it yet, so I'll be starting it for the first time today. I've had a lot of people say that, you know, say good things about it. So I'm hoping, hoping that it's it's good. Turn the lights off. It'll make everything look weird. Why'd you kill the music? I think you know why. Um, <laughs> I don't think I do. It begins with an L? Like the L word? Lesbians? Lost, Max, we're lost. We're just, we're in geographic flux. Right, so, lost. That's debatable. Take a moment to consider the following, as it will guide you through mm. the various twists and turns mm. that may appear during your stay at Hackett's Quarry. What you see here are quick time events, or QTEs, which will help you to act at just the right time. Watch your step. Hackett's Quarry can be a dangerous place if you're not paying attention to your surroundings. Take your eye off the ball, and it could spell disaster. The path you tread is yours to choose, but that doesn't mean there won't be any obstacles along the way. Oh, heads up. Yeah, honey, nice catch. I didn't know which button to push. Thank you. Man, the roads are definitely getting worse out here. I guess it's all part of the rustic summer camp experience. Oh, right, that's where we're going. I lost track like 200 miles ago. 200 miles ago, huh? Yeah. Graphics are pretty nice. You know what, Max, it's okay. It doesn't make you any less of a man. You know, if Columbus hadn't gotten lost and landed on these golden shores, there would be no United States of America. Goodbye hot dogs, see you later apple pie. Columbus never actually landed in North America. What are you talking about? Didn't even know he wasn't in Asia. Are you serious? Just another guy who didn't want to admit he was lost. Well, just another guy who's got a whole day named after him, so put that in your pipe and smoke it. Oh my god. Okay, just get us to camp already before I roll my eyes out of my head, please. <laughs> I'm working on it. I'm working on it. What is that? Yeah, yeah. No, but seriously, what happened to the, the normal map? This is the normal map. The one on the phone. Oh my goodness. No bars. This guy's an idiot. Of course not. I, I hate him already. Okay, let's see. So we are... Well, I guess they don't put summer camps on maps. Have you seen any signs for it? Hey, eyes on the road. Y'all see that? Are you okay? Yeah, yeah. I mean, still in one piece. Jesus Christ, what do you think that was? A bear? What? No, no, Max, it wasn't a bear. What was it? I think it was a person. Oh, are you serious? The sky. Do you think we oh my person? goodness. I don't know. I mean, it was really cl close, like really close, but maybe we didn't. What is it? I really have this car up. 
Well, maybe it looks worse than it is. Uh, I should check out the damage before we try to start it up again, huh? Could you grab my, uh, the, the toolbox from the trunk? Yeah, yeah, okay. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, when that hood comes down, there's gonna be someone about, oh, nope, I lied. In, in scary movies, whenever they open up a cabinet or like lift something up that covers the screen and it closes, there's always someone behind them. Always. It's not so bad. My mom's gonna kill me. At certain times throughout the night, opportunities will present themselves, giving you the chance to take matters into your own hands. It is worth noting that they are only suggestions. You don't have to act upon them. In fact, sometimes it's better not to. No. I don't want to rewatch it. Throughout the night, opportunities will present. Yeah, we have to rewatch it. Giving you the chance to take matters into your own hands. So won't let me skip. It is worth noting that they are only suggestions. You don't have to act upon them. In fact, sometimes it's better not to. I'm just trying to back out, but. Ah. I don't know. Is the creepy lady gonna be in the trunk? We're snooping. Yeah, actually, if you could just shine a light right here. Here you go. Perfect, thank you. The sooner we get out of here, the better. Just picture yourself um, curling up in front yeah. of a big old fire pit singing campfire sing-alongs. I don't think people curl up right in front of big old fire pits. Why not? Uh, they don't want to catch on fire. And then picture yourself curling up in front of a big old space heater. Well, anywhere's better than here. I don't know. How did she not see that? Where are you going? Just over here. Just stay there for a second, okay? I'm almost done. Max, hurry up! What's going on? I'm worried that there's somebody down there. Are you serious? Yeah, that, they could be hurt. I don't know. I didn't think we actually hit anyone. Well, I don't know. I just, I heard something, okay? Like a, a woman. Do you think we hit her? Why is he looking like that? I just want to check it out. Okay. All right. Just don't go too far, okay? Be yeah. careful. Yeah. Luck with the car. Yeah, ma'am, why are you wandering?
Did I miss something? Like, no. Just, no. Why? They really do just be asking to get killed. Silist dog boy. What are you doing? Yikes. This is too weird. Yes, it is. Oh my god. Jesus Christ. I think she's looking for someone named Silas. Could be wrong. Girl. I think I'm supposed to keep going. I don't think I'm supposed to go back. To the... Car. All these crazy angles.
whispering sweet nothings in my ear. Is that like a press any button? What's going on? What's going on? There's something out there. Like, I was, there was noises all around me. Honey, 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 take a breath. It's okay. It's the woods. There's a lot of stuff out there. There's animals. It's easy to freak yourself out. No. Can we just leave, please? Yeah, 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 yeah. Let's go. You all right? No. <laughs> Yes, no. there we go. Her and like, Sir, yeah. I am Next, not here okay. We here we go. We're getting out of here. Right? It just, it looks like she he just is staring at Max. her. Hot, hot. Okay, give me a minute. Give me a minute. We've got to go, Laura, man. You're not helping right now. Can you just I am trying to get us out of here. All right, just... enough. Shit, I'm sorry, honey. I'm sorry. We're safe in the car, really. We're gonna be okay. Jesus! Oh, fuck. fuck! Oh my god, my heart just exploded. Roll it down. Mm -hmm. Hi, officer. How are you doing this evening? Are either of you injured? Really, we're fine. We're just a little shaken up. Does he have some scratches on his neck? The cop? Oh, you folks want to tell me what happened here? Safety tip four. Hackett's quarry is full of twists and turns, unknown paths and unexplored wonders. With each step taken, you tread a path of your own, matched with its very own consequences. I like how these little there will be moments throughout are... your stay that show you that the choices you've made, the path you've chosen, it's could supposed have gone to be very like way. lighthearted. At Hackett's Quarry, there's no such thing as the wrong way. But be warned, some paths are more dangerous than others. Yeah, um... Uh... Well, we were just driving and it's really, really dark out here and, um... I don't know, we, we must have had like a, a pothole or something because we swerved and now here we are. I mean, these roads are really not in great shape. Yeah. Sir? Keep the car running. Sir? Is this kind of like the all-time scariest cop? I don't know. This is my first cop. What, like ever? Uh, yeah, I'm not a criminal. You folks want to tell me just what in the hell you are doing all the way out here this late at night? We're heading up to Hackett's Quarry Summer Camp. We're new counselors. You're one night early. No, no, we know. Um, but we figured we'd get in early and scope it out. You know, I mean, they know we're coming. We called ahead. And to be honest, sir, one of us kind of oversold their navigation skills and got us completely lost. You're not going to make it to Haggett's Quarry. Not tonight. Harbinger Motel. It's the nearest place you can bunk up there for the night, okay? Uh... 
I think we're just gonna stick to the plan, sir. I mean, Mr. Hackett knows we're coming and we called ahead. No, ma'am, you're gonna head to the Harbinger Motel. Do you understand? With all due respect, sir, why can't we go to Hackett's Quarry? Because I told you to go to the motel. Okay, sir? I just don't understand what the problem is. Ma'am, please step out of the vehicle. Whoa. What? Why? Officer, she didn't do anything. Ma'am, if you wouldn't mind stepping out of the vehicle, I would just like to show you a route on your map there. Okay. For sure. Son, remain in the vehicle. Okay. I don't know. I'm not really getting trustworthy vibes. Yes. Put a paper map on a wet car. Okay. So, we... Are right about here. Sorry, that's a pencil? Harbinger Motel is here. Right, okay, and where was Hackett's quarry again? Well, I'm sure the fine folks at the Harbinger Motel can guide you there first thing in the morning. But why doesn't he know where it is? Harbinger Motel. Stay on the road. Watch out for potholes. Don't you need like Have a, a statement? Have a good night. Why is this guy just sitting there? That guy was giving me major weirdo The dude needed like at least a dozen showers. Oh my god, I know. What was up with the thing? I Did you see was, that? Was it blood? Nice to meet you. Get back on the road. Yes. I think I've had enough woodland encounters for one night. Thank you very much. Agreed. So where's this motel? Okay, so we're here, mm -hmm. and the motel is here. Okay. But we're going here. What's there? Hackett's Quarry. How'd you do that? I don't know. I kind of tricked him into showing me. <laughs> very slick. Are you sure we shouldn't just get to the motel and just listen to this guy's advice? Honey, you really want to listen to the advice of some creep-ass cop who told us in the middle of the creep-ass woods to go to some creep-ass hotel? No, that sounds terrible. Yeah. Let's hit the road, shall we? That's what I thought. Ma'am. Oh my god! If he called me ma'am one more time, I was gonna shove that badge up his dick hole. <laughs> Seriously, do I look like a ma'am to you? I got like 20 years before I'm a ma'am. Mm-hmm. What? I... 20s debatable. Easy. I mean, I'm kind of into ma'ams. Okay, we're done here. <laughs> Uh-oh. You gotta be kidding me. There's nobody here. We drive all the way the fuck out Max, here. Max, can we just look around before we jump to conclusions? Did you actually even talk to Mr. Hackett or did you just leave a message? Well, what's the difference? This. This is the difference. Hello? Uh-oh. I guess he doesn't check his voicemail. How was I supposed to know that? She didn't actually tell them? I mean, clearly there's somebody here. Yeah, or it's just an abandoned car and this is a complete waste Why of time. Why would there be an abandoned... I'll beat the car. Max, come on. Max, don't be a dick. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Mm-mm. 
Is anybody home? Obviously not. I'm like kind of scared to shine the light in the windows, I'm not gonna lie. It's so dark on this side. Not a huge fan of the camera angle we got going on here. Trying to control the flashlight a little bit better. Nothing. Uh, I, I didn't know it was, it was a controller game. Laura, there's no one here. Come on. I was told Just never to shine a light minute, okay? out into the woods. Yeah. Or answer your name. <laughs> you hear your name being called in the woods. Don't, don't answer, don't answer it. What doesn't kill you makes you strong, makes you, will make you stronger. Fun. Oh yeah, that is a what great- What doesn't kill you will camp, make uh, you stronger. Great camp motto. What did you learn at summer camp? Well, I learned what well, doesn't kill you just makes you stronger. I see the door. I do see the door. Don't worry. So can you like pick up items and stuff? I'm so scared. I'm gonna like bring my flashlight across someone. Don't do it. That's like a basement door. You don't. You don't do that in the woods. No. Oh. Um. Bitch. Hey, are you okay? I'll be right back. I'm gonna get some help. Max! Max, get over here! What's going on? There's somebody in the bunker. I think they might be stuck. Like at each location, huh? there's a, a tarot card? I, I don't know. Just bring some tools so we can break the lock. Hey, I'm back. We're gonna get you out of there. Hey. hey. Wait, what, what are these? I don't know, you just said tools. What's floating? Why didn't you just bring... Look, there's someone in there. Um, I'm not seeing anyone. 
What? No, look. I'm looking. I am. There, there was definitely someone there. Okay, okay, so... Hammer time. You sure? It's gonna be super loud. <sighs> yeah, okay. Wrenches. Damn. Oh, if a wrench would just pop that off. You need a hand? Yeah. <sighs> You've seen the evil dad, right? Hello? Are you hurt? Do you exist? Hey, be careful. He's like, yeah, fuck. So how do you find the tarot cards? Will there be like an icon? You just walk close enough to get them. Okay. Yeah, maybe we shouldn't have come down here. Did I miss something? Find the uh, uh, when do I find the cards? Hun, maybe it was a possum or something. No, there was there was someone here. I swear. Hey. It's been kind of a night, you know? Yeah. Let's just get to the motel. We can come back here first thing in the morning. We can check everything out, but... I mean, you must be exhausted. I know I am. I think our imagination... Max? Max! I think Max just got got. She got him into this, come on. Oh, 
Does this look like the goddamn Harbinger Motel to you? No. Hello, my friend. Welcome to the show. We are friends, aren't we? Yes. I've waited for you. I've waited, yes. So I do hope our time together proves enlightening. There's no need to worry. I'm here to help you. Think of me as your guide into the unknown. It's exciting, yes and terrifying but if you're brave enough if you let me help you i can help you we can help each other you didn't find anything and so i've nothing to show you you need to look harder the cards are out there if you don't help me how can i help you we're supposed to be friends you said so yourself yeah. Search harder. Only you can find them. There are secrets out there, you know. Secrets and lies. Paths to uncover on which I can shed light, if you let me. Help me help you. And remember, what doesn't kill you will make you stronger. See you later, kids. Yeah, Hackett's quarry forever. <laughs> you know how many hearts are broken on the last day of summer camp? It's like a romance apocalypse. Yeah, well, I mean, they're just kids. You know, they'll get over it. Uh-huh, like they'll get over Emma? What? That's not the same thing. Oh, so that's not why you're in a bad mood. I'm not in a bad... Oh. <laughs> you know what? We had our last night together, and we're cool. Oh, yeah. So cool that you're never gonna see your special little boo-boo bear ever again. Jesus Christ, you heard that? Oh, huh? come on, dude. The cabin walls are made of band-aids and rat turds. <laughs> okay, I get it. <laughs> okay, quit it. Hi, Emma. Hey! Okay, this is, um... You've heard of spatial awareness before, yeah. right? Spatial awareness is for nerds. Uh, be a lamb and grab the last couple of bags, will ya? Yes, boss. 
Say hi to Emma for me. You're a bad person. Yes, I am. I will find a tarot card. Oh, hey. This is Emma's. I need, I need to explore more. Doesn't kill you will make you stronger. Not in the mood sign. <sighs> Gotta stay hydrated, chat. I'm gonna drink your water. That diet can. Diet can. That Diet Coke does not count. Neither does that Gatorade. Or the three cups of coffee you had this morning. What are you, uh, what are you listening to? Good to know. Are you guys gonna help with the bags or what? Oh, um, you know, I was actually just working on fixing uh, the door. It's Dylan, come it's on, broken. Dylan, please. I can't. It's. it's I gotta get the last bags what's in there. Come wrong on. with this thing? It's just. Dylan, please. Sorry, bro. <sighs> cool. Thanks, uh. guys. Bro, just kicked down the door. Uh, apparently this is after what we just saw happen. Skill. <sighs> like, they're counselors here. They can't just, like, walk in. Ugh. Horror. I hate horror. Ah, 
kind of have to like throw your mouse around a little bit. I just want to find a card. Is it really that much better with controller? Okay. Yeah, I already... I already read the... got the... Why is there so much furniture, like, blocking? the bags great all by yourself huh yep guess you're gonna have to get used to that oh my god you are so mean <laughs> at least i'm honest oh okay here we go okay you're not telling me the whole truth about you and emma are you son oh okay so now i'm the one who's not telling the whole story huh <laughs> oh well this is the bait i just gotta take jake I'll go back oh, sorry, inside. I just got so distracted about that rhyme. I forgot what we oh, were. Oh, no, 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 no. Uh, you, you were telling me how you totally have a thing for Ryan. Wait, are we talking about Ryan, the sailing instructor with the sexy brooding loner thing that totally doesn't do anything for me at all? <laughs> Knew it. <laughs> Who said I was hiding that? I'm not. I'm just saying, you know, I feel like if you really did like the guy, you would have made a move by now. So she really just dumped her ass, huh? I don't... Okay. Her whole thing is like, how are we going to make this work? Different schools, blah, blah, blah. My whole thing is like, you know, maybe long distance, blah, 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 blah. And she was just like, Jacob. She gave you the look, huh? Yeah, do not pass go. Man, she just got you wrapped all the way around that dainty little finger of hers. How does she do it? No, oh, but I mean, seriously, come on, she's right. It's just like a bit stupid summer fling. What else did I think was going to happen? Uh, let's see. Uh, love, stability, engagement, marriage, house, kid, affair, kid, divorce, loneliness, child support, visitation lawsuit, mm. surprise reconciliation, emptiness, retirement, grandkid, 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 a uh, nursing home, and finally, dying in each other's arms and then being buried in each other's arms like those thousand-year-old skeletons they dug up in Rome or something. Hmm. That kind in the ballpark? Oh, shit, I'm sorry. That was Ryan and me. Uh, let me see. Ah, here it is. Yours just says Roadhead. Oh, actually, that's just a generic all-men list. Well, that seems legit. <laughs> Such simple okay. creatures. So are we sure that this old rust bucket's roadworthy? <laughs> we'll take a look. It better be. One more night in the great outdoors might actually kill me. Hey, what doesn't kill you will make you stronger. Well, I haven't killed you yet. And you're still pretty pathetic. Hey, shut up. I want to go back and look inside, though. <sighs> uh, okay, so, um... Total hypothetical, but if I was like a huge asshole and I wanted to break down the van so we'd have to spend another night here, uh, what exactly would I need to do? 
Well, you'd probably break the fuel line or, I don't know, rip out the rotor arm. And yes, that would make you a total asshole. Okay, and what does a rotor arm look like again? It's like an arm that's all rotary. You know, it's under the little black dome with the leads poking out. Jake, you do realize that even if we somehow did get stuck out here, one more night with Emma wouldn't make a difference. Trust me, Chick's made up her mind. Yeah. Sure. Guess we'll just have to find out. Huh? Breaking it would be bad. Come on with me, buddy. I'll put you right back tomorrow. No harm, no foul. Up here, my dudes. Why did they look like they're up to something? Hey, Jacob. What? No, dude, please. D don't, don't. Go long. Oh, Nick. <laughs> How did I miss it? Uh, what? Come on, man. I'm so sorry, Jacob. <sighs> Rough. Hey, maybe uh, you should have put it in airplane mode. Oh, shit. But I hit it. Like What's when up, it... man? Shut the fuck up. Oh, yeah, no, no doubt. No <laughs> doubt. God damn, my mom's gonna kill me. Your mom? Oh, yeah, to, uh, to tell her I say hi. <laughs> I, I don't know how I missed it. I'll pay to fix it as soon as we're back, man. Well, it's bricked. Crap. Oh, thank God. Huh. Not a peep. Either got zero signal, everybody's already forgotten I exist. I got all the you other know, ones. I can go one more day without a phone. And I thought I hit it at the right place. Day? The drive's not that far. You know what I mean. Where's everybody else? Why why would I know that? Mm -hmm. Sometimes you know stuff I don't. Look, I don't I don't even know how to respond to that. You say Nick, you're way smarter than me, and you're a super hot stud who gets any cheeky ones. Okay, yeah. Keep dreaming, Junior. I want to go back and search the tarot card. Hey there, party bear. Status report? We are officially empty nesters. High five up top. I don't get oh, it. Oh, too slow. Really? I'm... Oh boy. Which You're one about to get is your phone it... back, aren't you? Let's go collect our bags oh. and away from this mosquito-infested backwoods dump. Doors locked. Bags inside. <sighs> Fuck me. Yep. Some of y'all are saying L. Some of y'all are saying right. Find someone with a key. Shape our destiny. And by shape our destiny, I mean shape our way through this crappy lock and grab our bags. I chat be nice. I am pushing up though. I don't understand. I don't I it was easier on the freaking keyboard. Okay. Let's do it. We better not get into trouble. I won't tell if you won't tell. Mr. Hackett's gonna find out. Have to do both so of what? them? Both I'll sticks? just think it was a bear or something. Have you ever seen a bear in these woods? No, but that doesn't mean they're not out there. What do you mean circling up at the same time? That doesn't make Fair sense! Point. That doesn't right, make let's sense! Do this. On three. One. Two. Three! Ugh. Don't understand what, what oh, you mean circle. About the power. I'm not understanding thinking. that. Why do I ever listen to you? Because I'm always right. Are you sure they're gonna think it was a bear? Oh my god, relax. It's not like we killed someone. 
All right, well, I'm just gonna take another look around, make sure we didn't miss anything. Go nuts. Are you saying I need to click them? Aw, this was little Izzy's. I wanna play a game! <laughs> Don't do it again. get you back to Izzy. I can't believe I'm actually gonna miss all those lumpy loose springs. Huh? Okay. Why would this place be in the news? No tarot card. Yeah, I want to go back to the main house. It wasn't... I haven't been able to. Can I actually go into any of this? Movement's definitely better. Is that Emma? Oh, wait. to explore everything. Back this way real quick. Ouch. Let's hope Jacob hasn't seen this. Tough. 
Anything over here? Hey! You stop <gasps> that! Not a good, uh, not a good sign. Not a good sign. It's gonna be weird not waking up to Dylan's morning announcement. face I see where all I can go here Pretty stream. I don't think anyone knocked Caitlin out of first place all summer. Really, the girl from Modern Family? Oh, nice. That's so cool. That is pretty neat. Ready to roll? Time to let loose and vamoose this caboose. How are you so... Dramatic. Annoying. Confident. It's just acting. It's what the people want. Yeah, so I saw Brenda. I mean, in a way, faking it is just being yourself, but louder. You should try it sometime. You never know who you might impress. No. <laughs> it's too late now anyway. For what? That'd be Your sick. Neck? I want to. I want to get featured. In you like never this. know unless you put yourself out there. I don't understand. Eyes on the road, lady. Sorry. 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 Okay. So hypothetically, if I were to put myself out there, I'm hitting what it. What if I end up being a dud, kind of like you and Jacob? He's actually. Really sweet. Moving the movement on controllers so much easier. In. Summer fling. We're going to school like four states away. I he gets it. Yeah, sure. But oh, that's us. You and Nick could be different. When do you get his handle? Hit him up. Oh, I already have his email. It was in the packet they gave to us on the first day. Email? Are you 93? What's wrong with email? I'm really gonna miss you, Abby. Oh, but the lodge is that way. Go right here. Why? Come on, scenic route? One last victory lap around the camp? I'm confused.
Scenic route's never a good idea. Okay, fine, scenic route. Yes. Sure, what's the victory? Two months. No technology. I kind of thought it was nice. When do I actually move the joystick? Like, you know what I mean? To be offline. Ugh, I didn't. Plus, my subs need me. As soon as the icon shows? After touches the smaller circle. You know what? I actually believe you. Babby, was that a compliment? Your charm is infectious. What can I say? <laughs> I'd subscribe. You better. As soon as you get home, sub, share, smash that like button. The holy trinity. Both sticks, small circle. Okay, well now I'm really regretting it. When it hits the smart, oh, small no, circle. You love me. <laughs> My favorite spot. The fire pit? The island. Mad secluded, right? Is is that smoke? Should we tell someone? Mm, it looks pretty contained. It's probably just Mr. H burning some stuff before, you know, he closes camp for the summer. Yeah. Speaking of which, we should we should probably, you know, get back. Oh yeah. Worried Nick's, you know, gonna leave without you. Well, no, they're probably like all waiting for us. Mm-hmm. Everyone's waiting for us. Everyone, yeah. Nick, waiting for you. All everyone, same. Mm-mm. Don't worry, Jacob, I got you. I got a full tank of gas, so. Oh, fuck me. <laughs> oh, idiot. <laughs> Does nobody own phone chargers anymore? Hey, there's no signal out here anyways, dude, okay? This place is like patchy as balls. <sighs> Your balls are patchy? What? No. It's okay, I'll just go get some juice from Mr. H before we go. And... Uh, you. <sighs> Hey, Nick. Hey, where were you guys? <gasps> Wouldn't you like to know? Ignore her, please. Let's go. Just gotta get these bags up on to the... Oh, hey, hey, here. Let me, um, let me get it for you. I can take care of my own bag, thank you. What? Are you the sure? Eyes are it's, a I mean, funky. it's really not that big she of a deal. She can take care of her own bag, thank you. We can both take care of our own bag, thank you. Cool. Uh, uh, Abby, do you need? Yeah. Can I? Thank you. Aww. Hey, has anyone seen Ryan? Oh yeah, he's probably off being all brooding and mysterious and alluring somewhere. <laughs> I'm here. What were you doing under there? Having a little knee party? Uh, I was listening to a podcast, actually. Oh, podcast, nice, that's cool. Ryan seems like the one What's guy that, that would actually survive. Yeah, what's it about? Is it about me? You think I was listening to a podcast about you? Okay, if anyone here had a podcast about them, it'd be me. Yeah, if there was a podcast called How to Look and Smell Like a Butt. Oh my god, you are so childish. At least I don't look and smell like a butt. No, it's a, it's a paranormal podcast. This episode was actually about this place, weirdly enough. The Hag of Hackett's Quarry. 
the who of the what's it where now? What's the hag of Hackett's quarry? You don't know about the hag of Hackett's quarry. Uh, if I did, would I be asking them ass? Tell her about the hag of Hackett's quarry. I don't think she wants to know about the hag of Hackett's quarry. <laughs> okay, can we just please stop saying the hag of Hackett's quarry? It's just this campfire story for the kids. It's, um, there's supposedly an old woman who died in a fire a few years back. She haunts the woods looking for her lost baby boy. There are like reports of whispers or whatever, and then this figure that floats around, you know, textbook ghost stuff. Some people say that if she catches you alone, she'll try to turn you into her son or kill you or something. I don't know. It's never really been clear. Anyways, Haga Haggett's Corey. You made that up. It's right here in the podcast, man. Cool story, bro. Seriously, though, you should have seen the first time you told the story to the kids at the campfire. They were scarred for life. I mean, not for <laughs> life. You gotta be careful with this stuff, man. This shit's true. Come on, dude, bullshit. What's the holdup, Hacketeers? Yeah, I'm uh, nearly done, Mr. H. Or hop to it. Get those butts in gear. He looks familiar, too. Are these all... Sorry, Mr. H. Yeah, deliberate some luggage. Shut up. Actors and actresses? Maybe if somebody didn't spend so much time trying to press the ladies with all his ghost stories. You asked. Ghost stories? The Hag of Hackett's Quarry. Oh! <sighs> They're all hey, you still have the van key, Mr. H? That's so cool. Well, yes, I do. But you know, I'd lose my head if it wasn't stuck on. Back to the office I go. Give me a hand, would you, Ryan? Oh, okay. Yo, Mr. H. What's up, DJ Dylan? Any chance I could get a little charge? I want to have some uh, tunes for the road. No can do. Come on, that's like super unchilled. Hey, dude, I'm like the chillest flipping bro in the whole world, man. I just need some tunes for the ride, man. <laughs> all right, that's enough. Five minutes? Like, like five minutes, that's all I need, man. You said no, Dylan. Okay, yeah, I know, but I was just... I'll meet you at the van, okay? Damn. The first... Girl, the so, first blonde uh, girl. Chris, I I'm actually glad we got a moment to Looks talk. So about. I uh, think of what her uh name oh, is. I'm not fired, am I? <laughs> no, no, it's, um, it's just you know about the whole thing w with the. Hold that thought, partner. I'm gonna have to take this. Oh yeah, okay. Oh, uh, sorry. Hello. Kids are kids. You can only do so much, you know. They're almost out of here, all right? You're cutting it pretty close. We don't want to have... Just hold your damn horses, all right? Everything's A-OK -okay on this end. Bobby and I are geared up. If he's in the area, we'll get him. This is a waste of time. You know it, I know it. No, should Why? I have... All the adults are very sus. Probably staying out of the way. Speaking of which, the longer you keep me on this damn phone, the longer it's gonna take me to get rid of these damn kids. Yeah, of course. Adios. Boy, move from the door. You hear the footsteps. Sorry, I, I wasn't. I wasn't listening. I, I was just like waiting. Like I mean, I heard. 
I mean, I, was, I didn't hear what you were... We're saying. cool, champ. Just come on in. Sorry I pushed you out like that. You, uh, you need a hand looking for the keys? Uh, no, end of summer, busy, busy, you know. Anyway, you were asking me? Oh, uh, yeah, yeah, it was just the whole animation school thing, what you thought I should do. Right. Y you know, listen, uh, whether or not I should, like, leave my sister with my grandparents, since I'd have to live on campus, you know, and my mom's not exactly around, so I wouldn't want to leave Sarah on her own. You know, fam our family's small enough as it is. Well, family is important, Ryan. Dang it. Is everything okay? You got a hot day tonight? Oh boy. If you only knew. <laughs> So, uh, what, what did you need me for? You're one of my favorite counselors, Ryan. You know that. Aw. One of the good ones. But, do you know how many calls I get from parents, letter after letter, with these terrified kids that they send home? Huh. I, I, I didn't realize that. Believe it or not, scaring kids away from sleepaway camp is kind of bad for business. So, maybe just... Ease up on the ghost stories. Sorry, I didn't realize it was such a big deal. Gotta understand the repercussions of your actions, Buster. Ryan seems a big like a part nice of being guy. A counselor, a leader. Yeah. Just stick to kumbaya next time, okay? What's that? You guys don't do kumbaya anymore. Good grief. I'm outgrowing my own cliches. Seriously, Chris, what's going on? I just want to get you guys safely out of Dodge before the sun goes down. Why? It's getting dark, Ryan, and it's not safe to drive in the dark. And safety is the first step towards fun. Just give me a minute. Where in the good goddamn are they? Will you say goodbye to Caleb and Kaylee for me? They sort of just snuck off. Well, you'll see them again next year. Caleb works at the scrapyard during the off-season, and Kaylee, well, she's still figuring out what she wants to do. She's got her whole life ahead of her. They both just come and go as they please, really. Teenagers, am I right? Actually, could have used the help packing up since we were short-staffed. Hey, you guys seem to manage all right. But I'll tell them both you were sad you missed them. Unlocked the van. Put the keys in my pocket, came in the office. Right where I left him. Uh -huh. Let's skedaddle. I need to look for the tarot card in, in, in the lodge. Let me go back to the lodge. Let me explore the lodge. Make sure they're all ready to go. For real this time. Wait, how did you get You'll your phone back it? before the rest of us? But I don't know if it's it going to let me go back into the lodge and explore. You should have turned it off before you handed it in, Dylan. Them's the rules, you noob. Yeah, you noob. I try not to dwell on the past, man. Good. Cause it's time to dwell in the minivan. Get on with our respective lives. Move it, let's go. What's the problem? Ugh, oh, dude, I don't know. I, I think there's something wrong with the engine, Mr. H. Yeah, I can see that. Yeah, dude, it's just like, kaput. All right, let me try. What, 
Dude, I'm telling you, all right? It's busted. Well, maybe you're doing Bro, it wrong. Well, maybe you're doing it wrong. The fuck, dude? Enough. Enough, both of you. Shit. Come on. All right, Come dude, on. Chill. Chill, Let's go. dude. Ah, God. Damn it! I thought I told you kids to check everything. No, we did. It, it should be working. Yeah, well, coulda and shoulda doesn't mean it is, does it? Damn it! Okay. Uh, okay. Well, uh, look, it's not that big of a deal, okay? We'll just spend one more night here. No! No! Just stop. Let me think. Damn it. You're right, you're right, yeah. What? Yeah, you're right. Fuck. No, god damn it, dude! Beefed it. I'm I, I, it has to be bugged. I, I got it perfectly on the keyboard. Every single time I hit it right on the, right on the nail. Hey, Brian. the keyboard. Come here for a sec. Can't restart. Make sure that everybody Chat, is don't inside be mean. the lodge. I was tonight. literally hitting Lock it doors, every single time no on the keyboard. In, no one out. No one. Got okay. it? Okay. Okay. I'll be back first thing in the morning. And we'll get you all on the road. You just have to keep everyone inside. Can you promise me you'll do that? Yeah, sure. We'll, we'll stay inside. When you hit B and Attaboy. the left joystick, why do you have to hit B though? Lock the doors. And for God's sake, keep the noise down. I know the keyboard movement was just wonky. So, what was that about? Yeah said to stay inside that we're not leaving until the morning are you kidding me um are you kidding me what are we supposed to do well we should go inside like he said we could go inside until morning yeah or or we could do something else No, 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 no. We should really listen to what Chris told us to do. Of course. Uh, who cares what Chris told us to do? He's not our boss anymore. P-A-R-T. Why the fuck not? All right, it seems like the stars have aligned for us, no? No, they haven't. Okay, no. Okay, no, okay. No, they haven't. One last epic bonfire blowout for all time. Oh, dude. Fuck yes. I'm in, Nick. You're in. Yeah, I'm in. Dylan's in. Chat, obviously. if I miss if my I miss man. it again, Caitlin? I'll I'll move back to I go keyboard. Where my people need me. Yeah, okay. M. What do you say? Mm. <laughs> yeah, I'm in. Mr. Hackett seemed pretty insistent we stay in the lodge. He was just trying to freak us out, you know? Like um like one of Ryan's stupid ghost stories. Why would he want to scare us? I don't think he was trying to freak us out, Jacob. I think he was really freaked out by something. Jesus Christ. Chris seemed real serious about this, guys. Just say you're in, man. Come on, one last night. Yeah, Dude, he won't even know. I, I promised. I no, 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 D dude, dude. It's all good. All right, we get it. You know, you uh, you don't want to disappoint Daddy. Whatever, man. It's gonna be fine, man. Trust me. It's gonna be chill. All right, all right, all right. Hacketeers, party planning committee. Let's do this. Um, okay. First things first. 
Nick and Abby, you go get some firewood. Uh, M and I will go to the stores for some supplies. And uh, Dylan, you just I how don't know, are you going to go to the store? The cars the or something not working. All right, let's do this. Sniper scope. priest guy from Game of Thrones, is it? You know? I was hoping you'd come back I didn't today. find any tarot cards, man. Let's see what you found. Nothing. Empty-handed. You need to look around you, find my cards, and I can help I you. I told you I wasn't going to be I'm able from, to get back. we look out for each other. Find them, please. You'd better be going. It's still early and the moon is bright, but time won't wait. Not for those with a story to tell. Be careful. Look out for yourselves. And look out for my cards. I'm trying. I'm trying to find them. So here we are, stranded in the great American wild with nothing but our wits to guide us. Will humanity prevail or will we grow ravenous and resort to eating the flesh of the deceased like I saw in that one plane crash movie? <laughs> First course, filet au Jacob. Rich and full bodied, this rare beefcake may leave an irritating taste lingering on the palate. An acquired taste, some would say. Well. What? Looks like you're trying to thread a needle with a packet of loose sausages. Oh my god, I'm almost done, okay? Jesus Christ. And for the record, your analogies are very hurtful. Okay, I'm almost there. One second. Whoa. And scene. Oh, I mean, I could have kicked it. You listened it for me. Mm -mm, slab. I haven't played that one. Okay. So, if I were a beer, where would I be hiding? Probably on one of the shelves. Beep, beep, beep. I don't beep, like this guy. Beep, I hope what? he dies. Beep, what are you doing? Beep. Oh. <laughs> uh. It's my beer dar. Helps me dar for beers. Huh. How am I just noticing how super lame you are? What? But it it's my beer dar, dude. I'm just gonna I'm gonna go over here. Wow, the kids really wiped this place out. Mr. H loved his accessories.
Girl, don't do it. No, <laughs> not the safe. I think it's locked. Don't know what I was expecting. <laughs> uh oh. Oh, hell yeah! <laughs> oh! Jackpot! Hey, uh, check out my giant melons. Oh. See, you just cut a hole in it. Mm hmm. You pour in your vodka. It's party time. You just you pour the vodka right in it. Yeah, it's the most fun you could have with a hole in a watermelon. Or, well, second most. Okay, I'm gonna leave you two alone and go look for some more party supplies. I hate this guy. I don't like him. I don't like him. I would vote him off the island. Immediately. Homie is immediately getting voted off. It is so much easier to control with the controller though. Oh. Then I f oh, that's not a tarot card. Harem scarum. I got excited. Where are you? This angle is very close to the back of her head. Who buys this crap? I mean, basically just the way that I win. I just don't get how the camp isn't su safe suddenly. Um, from what I've gathered from playing through so far, it sounds like there's some crazy locals. Okay, think about it as if there's werewolves, okay? And they want to get all the campers out before the full moon. Because if they're not out, they're going to be hunted and killed. Does that make sense? Using that as, a, uh, as an analogy. That makes sense, I tried. This goes locked. <laughs> the bad bitch, kick the door. Don't break your ankle, though. Ow! Mother Hubbard! Ah! Ah! <sighs> what you uh? What you done to your foot there? That looks painful. Shut up. I jinxed it. Don't you know not to kick a reinforced door? Done. Nice. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> Whoa. Mother Hubbard. Fucking mother love. Good golly, Miss Molly. 
No wonder he kept this place locked up. You think he'll be pissed when we made a stash? What? No. I mean, he left us stranded here. It's like, um... <clears throat> Doors are surprisingly hard to kick Human in. Human rights, sir. Aren't you supposed to kick right next Whatever. to the, sure. the handle? Yeah. All right. Now let's see what we are working with. Hold that. The door will latch otherwise. Don't let that go. Oh. Hell yeah. In and out. Job done. Boom. I want to look around. Go for it. What do we got? Post a donkey kick it? The more you know. Jacob! Check this out. What? I can't move or else the door will latch. You look like camping supplies. Oh, okay. Um, there's tents back at the fire pit, so just let's let's go. Did a bear do this? I don't know. We are in the woods, girl. Oh, cool. What? What is it? A gun. Oh, cool. And a code. To the lock, perhaps? Girl. Okay. I'm done. A bullet. I don't think I can actually, like, do anything else here. Looks like I got... I looked at everything. My screen. I know, I know. I'm trying to find the tarot cards. I don't think there's any in here. I hope there's none in here. I'm gonna be sad. Oh. So you're, uh... You do the same thing IRL? Gun, huh? If I pick up a gun, yeah. I'm not gonna be pointing that thing around. You know I me? Mean? Okay. Uh, well, I am gonna find something to haul this lot back to camp. Okay, that was that. Yeah, I've pretty much searched this entire place. door I no longer like this place All right I'm in Hey, very nice. <laughs> what else is in there? Uh, just some fireworks. W oh, fireworks? Yeah, but I don't think we should- No, 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 Emma. Fireworks. No. I feel like fireworks are crossing a line. What? But you got a gun. Why can't I have firecrackers? Because the gun is for bear protection, and the fireworks could start a forest fire. <sighs> Stupid forest fires. <laughs> hey, I found these, like, torn-up 
bags back there. They were pretty messed up, and I think they might have had blood on them. Oh, oh, stop. Stop. Stay right there. Uh, <sighs> oh, dude. Peanut butter butter pops. Dude, peanut butter I hate this fucking guy. butter pops. I hate this guy. Aren't those for kids? What? Yeah, yeah, and I used to be a kid. <laughs> used to be? Okay, um, look, just try one of these puppies. I promise you, you will change your tone. Not a chance. Why no fireworks? Pop, pop, peanut butter, butter, I hate butter this guy. Pops. I don't pop, want to do pop, what he pop wants. Pop them in your mouth. <laughs> no. look, come on, they're like the greatest snack of all time. All right, whatever. You know what? More for me. Well, <clears throat> I saw a wheelbarrow out front, so we can load up all our booty in there. Uh, I'm sorry, what? Booty? Oh, it means like, um, like treasure or buds. <laughs> no, before that. Wheelbarrow? Uh, yeah. Um, okay. Uh, it's like, um, it's like a barrel with wheels. You can put stuff in it and just wheel it around. Oh. I see. Ladies first. Mm -hmm. Which way? Hmm. All right. A lot of dust around this the place. Inner sanctum. It's just an office. This is where the magic happens. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Let's just make this quick. Sure. Just give me a sec to get this going. No, I think she asked what that was because of and how he pronounced it. Engage. Podcasts. Yeah. All right. Uh, what's it called, the one that you're listening to right now? Uh, Bizarre Yet Bonafide. So, like, ghosts and stuff? It's like, um, yeah, like, the the weird and the wonderful, digging up weird mysteries and discussing if they're, well, bonafide. <laughs> boner fide. Get it? Boner. <laughs> Your wit knows no bounds. So, should we check out what Mr. H keeps in his private den of sin? Uh, I don't know, man. I feel a little weird going through his stuff. Okay, well, I don't. SMH. I mean, come on, what kind of dirty secrets is the owner of a summer camp full of impressionable young children gonna have anyway? Uh ha ha. <laughs> Not Mr. H, I know, he's cool. It's always been cool to me. Can't you, like, speed it up at all? I can try to encourage them. Go for it! You guys can do it! It's not working. <laughs> just, we're gonna have to wait. This guy is kind of a little... He, he has his moments. Hey, what's the gun for? Shooting things? Uh, Chris... Mr. H told me it was for, um... Bears. Bears? Here? Yeah, yeah, he said they don't really come around because he's got the gun to... Yeah. <laughs> Just leave it alone. Just leave it alone. Dude, what if we're out partying tonight out in the woods and we end up in a sort of most dangerous game situation like when people hunt other people yeah yeah what i mean think ryan about it. guy's it's pretty smart is over and hunting season has just begun true what if what if okay bear with me here what if what's on the menu tonight is us well then i guess we getting would a little need too to real ourselves. getting a little too exactly real. that's why we need the gun mm. for protection yeah not gonna happen what about for fun no okay yeah, yeah, totally. Well, 
We know where the gun is, if we need it. Your call, man. The foreshadowing. Well, hello, what is this? You hear that? Is that a trap door? <laughs> Secret sex dungeon. Yeah, I guess it goes to the basement. Huh. But why would Mr. H have a secret trap door in his office that goes to the basement? Maybe it was here before this was his office. He's like a million years old. This has always been his office. It's probably for storage. Yeah, or so that he can make a quick getaway when the heat comes down. Oh, uh, okay. Or it's for storage. Go ahead, open it up. Do we want to do that? All right, well, it looks like a pit of eternal darkness, so. You're being dramatic. Climb down, take a look. Look, you can squeeze through there. You opened it, you climb down. I don't want to die. Okay, fine. Down we go. What's down there? Oh my god, Ryan, you will what? not believe this. What, what, what? It's nothing. Oh, hey. Oh. I had you go in there for a second, didn't I? No. Maybe. Just <laughs> shut up. It is uh, pretty spooky down here, though, and it smells very unnatural, so... I would go back yeah, up. Yeah, okay, I'm coming back up. <sighs> Ooh, that's a nice chair. I could get used to this. I feel like maybe you I should hope Mr. H doesn't catch you taking his baby out for a joyride. <laughs> Ring -a -ding -a -ding. Oh, sorry, bud. Gotta take this one second. Hello, Hackett's Quarry Summer Camp. What doesn't kill you will make you stronger. What can I do for you on this darn tootin' doozy of a day? Is that your impression of Mr. H? Uh, yeah. Uh-huh. Yeah. Yeah, I. you're absolutely right. He does need to be nicer to Dylan. And, uh, what's that? You want him to give Dylan his phone number? That's a little forward, but I can see what I can do. Smooth. <laughs> Oh, Laura Kearney and Max Brindley. Oh yeah, those are the ones that never showed up. Yeah, it's because of these goobers that we had to work extra shifts this summer. That's a lot. Kaylee and Caleb Hackett. Weird kids, huh? Rude. I like them. Yeah, me, I, me too. Um, they are pretty reclusive, you have to admit. Whoa, look at this old thing. Hey, give me your number. I want to try it out. 
Why? Oh, no reason. I just thought it'd be nice for somebody to call you for a change. Ooh, good burn. <laughs> Thank you. I thought it was pretty good. Hello? What? Who is it? Hello? It's weird. I, I thought I thought I heard someone. Maybe we should stop touching stuff. <sighs> Fine. I think that's pretty much oh. Yo, my guy, toss me the keys Uh, so you can poke around in Chris's private area? I I'm no sorry, is that something yet. that only you're allowed to do? Hardy har har <laughs> Come on, what's the harm in looking? It's... You're not a little bit curious? I'm not gonna touch anything. Fine. Don't let me regret it. Can't promise that, but... Nothing but that. <laughs> You're using that wrong. Got it. Oh. I got it this time. Huh. Whoa, there's some pretty heavy-duty stuff in here. Yeah, maybe let's not touch that. I'd yeah, be there's nothing fun. <laughs> Fashion icon. Mr. H knows what he likes. Sure he does. Wow, there's... Yo. Hey, hey, maybe we shouldn't... Bro. Uh, Brian? Whoa, what the fuck? These monitors, this is the camp. Huh. Is Mr. H spying on us? No, no. I mean, no, no, he can't be. These are just, they're all different trails in the woods around camp. <laughs> sure. <laughs> Most of the cameras are pointed away from camp, so it's not like he's spying on the kids. Unless they wandered out into the woods. You know, these are just... No, I don't have any cards. Trail cameras. What are trail cameras? People I set have them up none to of them. catch weird, random shit. Okay, yeah, like what? Like uh, Bigfoot sightings, you know, that kind of thing. I didn't know that Mr. H was into that kind of stuff. Shit, maybe he likes that podcast that you listen to. Secret hobby, I guess. Expensive hobby. Yeah, well, I mean, what else are you gonna do out here? Yeah, I guess camp probably does get pretty lonely when there's no one else around. Yeah. Okay, but why go through all the trouble of hiding this room through a secret door in the closet? Seriously, uh, I would hide in this I place. Mean, it's not exactly secret, right? Like, it's just hidden by stuff. Yeah, that's what a secret is, Ryan. It, it's weird. It's majorly yeah, weird. Man. I don't disagree with you, but it, it's it's got to be something juicy in here. Dylan, okay. it's it's none of our business. And if you really want to know, you can ask him tomorrow. I'm sure, that won't be an awkward conversation, like at all. Okay, yeah, maybe I will. All right. I I'm leaving this secret layer. Have fun. Hey, you just admitted that it's a secret layer. What's that? It's probably nothing. What? Bro. What do you mean it's nothing?
Okay, these are boring. Nothing? That really didn't trigger anything? Huh. I wanted to see if there was going to be anything else. But these never, this didn't show anything. Bunch of X's though. I cook? No. I don't cook. Not often. At least close the door behind you, you know? nothing All right Nice. Full up. So, got anything going on when you get back home? School or? Uh, jury's out. Understood. Girlfriend? Uh, not exactly. Boyfriend? Free agent. Cool, yeah. Aww. Me too. Are the, uh, phones... Picking up a uh, vibe? Yeah, probably. You want to check? Oh, let's just give them another mm -hmm. minute. The real too. actors let's and the sure. actresses. Well, I don't think there's any tarot cards in here. I really have looked everywhere this time. I really should close that door, though. Nice. Full up. I don't hey, think there's any cards. All right, cool. Let's go. 28%? I would let that shit charge to 100. Thank you. Close the other door. Close the other door. What are you doing? It'd be a lot easier with Mr. H's chainsaw. 
It's really very pretty out here when there's no kids around. Yeah, they can get kind of obnoxious, huh? Yeah. <laughs> they always seem to listen to you during painting class. You've seen my class? Just walking by. <laughs> the art cabin's all the way out of the way. Yeah, well, there's this shortcut that I take that goes by. Oh. Which way Young should we go? Young love. Why don't you choose? She is the girl from Modern Family. Um, hmm. Feeling the rocky road like the like the ice cream. Good choice. Better sticks this way. Better sticks? Yeah. You're like burning or whatever. <laughs> Think we've got enough? Uh, not yet. Heating up. Gotta backtrack, make sure we, you know, nothing hiding back here. I don't think we can actually go anywhere. For good measure. The cute little love music. I'm guessing if you slide down there, you can't get back up. That's how it's looking. There's a tarot where. I did just like completely circle behind me. Hmm? Oh. So this place was an actual quarry? Uh, yeah. Apparently, some of the caves are in pretty deep. It's like That's never a good idea. Cool. Deep caves in the middle of the forest. You know? Are you sure this is safe? What, are you scared? No. Are you? No. Two paths, chat. Two paths. <laughs> Maybe I can do both?
What? Nice. We got one. Lots of paths. So, you ever think about what's next? Like, after we die? It's heavy, man. No, I mean, like, the future. Yeah. Sometimes. Hurt my butt sound like that. All the time. <laughs> so overwhelming. I know what you mean. Sometimes I just try to, like, let it happen, you know? Yeah. Huh? Like, whatever happens is what was meant to happen. Like it's all predetermined. Fate. I don't know. I'm not sure we're supposed to know. Yeah. Fate just seems so... Convenient. How so? Because if it's all predetermined and you do something terrible, then you have the excuse of saying, well, it wasn't really me because everything's been pre-planned and then I'm not really in control of my actions, am I? Eep. I never really thought about it like that before. I mean, well, it's, it's totally okay if you believe that. Yeah, no, totally. Yeah. There's three different paths. I feel like this might be a big circle. Brave. Is there anything here? That was pointless, I guess. Oh, yeah, Nissa. Yeah, I know. I don't even get in that water. Okay, this looks like a loop, but I still want to go around it just in case. Okay, there was nothing. Come on, lady. Okay, it's not letting me walk that way. Right, where's the cute music? There it is, there it is. So romantic. Young oh, I know love. Where we are. Yeah? 
Up here. Here, hold these. Sure. So cute. This view is just... Wow. Someone's about to get murked. Feel it? AC, thanks for the uh, raid. I appreciate that. Thank you. Thank you, thank you. We're playing the new, uh... Quarry. There we go, I said it right. Quarry game. It's pretty good. It is pretty good. Damn, Abby, you're really good. No, I'm pretty close to the beginning. This is, this is only the second. <laughs> no, really, I'm not just saying that. This is Rude. rough, but if I can get a little bit of it down, then I'll remember it better later. I know. I was saying query. It's really cool you know that about yourself. And then chat was like, "No, you're wrong." Um, yeah, I guess so. Quarry. I mean, not everyone knows what they're capable of, you know. I'm sure you're capable of a lot, Nick. I mean, of course. I just don't know what. Mm hmm All the characters are actors and actresses. I'll figure it out. You were supposed to pronounce it Cory? English is so confusing. Oh my goodness. Did you hear that? Hmm? It's probably nothing. No, listen. There's something there. Sounds like a little pig. Oh, it's a little piglet. It's so tiny. Oh my god, he's so cute. Uh-oh. Hold on. Danger. Hunted by a creature of indeterminate origin. Don't breathe. You need to stop breathing. Tricking the beast into taking you for nothing but a corpse. And where's the fun in hunting then which is already dead? Watch the visuals alter or listen to the sound change as the threat approaches. When the danger has passed, run. Pick the right moment and run for your life. Be warned. Exhaling or running at the wrong time may just mark you as the creature's quarry, causing serious consequences. Mommy, you're dead. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> oh, little piggy hog. <laughs> At least we gave her a good story to tell her pig husband. How do you know it was the mommy pig? Mm, I got a pretty good look. Ew. I think she was coming on to me. <laughs> Got yourself a little girlfriend. She wasn't that little. <laughs> Cringe. <laughs> that 
that bag must be like Hermione's bag because that that was a big she notebook she just put in there. Thing just disappeared. Bottomless bag, yeah. Back to Brenda. Well, I don't know what her name. I forgot what her name is in game. Finally, get my phone back, and it's just a big dumb brick. I zoom in. Hey, Caitlin. Guess what? Mr. H is a voyeuristic creep. He has hidden cameras everywhere and a secret room. No, that's not... Uh, whoa, now. Back up. What? His eyes are everywhere. He's always watching us. Knock it off, man. He, he's just got... Trail cameras set up, you know, forest surveillance, that kind of thing. Oh. You don't think that's weird? No. Well, he's got a perimeter to check, kids to protect. You know, probably just to keep track of wildlife. You guys have no imagination. So, uh, what's going on here? Everything ready? Still no service. Ah, uh, yeah. So, pretty boring. I wonder, maybe a satellite fell out of the sky or something? Yeah, and landed in the forest, waking from her slumber, the hag uh, hacking. Okay. Yeah, it's Brenda's song. Mm -hmm. You know, I just realized we may never see each other again after tonight. You Everyone in this is an actor or actress. The mood. What mood? The mood, the vibe, you know. Speaking of setting the mood, I have work to do. Okay, because playlists don't make themselves. I mean, I guess they do, but... All right, right guy. Time to get wood. Yikes. Wording. Oh, I know what I said. Abby, Nick, just in time. We got wood. <laughs> We've already done that joke. It's mostly just kindling. Oh, that's all we need. There's already a big pile of logs here. We could have gotten more, but there was a hog or a boar, but Nick was very, very brave and took one for the team. Oh my gosh, it can't be. The hog of Hackett's quarry? What? I thought you hated that phrase. <laughs> big jokes take big sacrifices. You're so brave. Oh. I just want to shrink you down to little pocket people and put you in my pocket and peep at you when I need a little pick-me-up. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Whoa. Special delivery. Did you just fire that off? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Where the hell did that gun come right, from? Dude, relax, okay? It's not even real. Uh... Well, I mean, it's a real gun, but it's just for shooting bears. We found it in the storage room. Okay, fine, fine, we'll put it down. Thank you. Guns are no joke, dipshit. And, and, we bring you a hand-picked selection of only the finest that Hackett's Quarry has to offer. No freaking way. Yes, freaking way. Pop, pop, peanut butter, butter pops. Pop, pop, pop them in your mouth. Pop! I didn't even know you could still find these anyway. Oh, hey, hey, cool your jets there, cowboy. All right, these... Are spoken for. Dude, you can't just shove those in my face and not expect me to want to pop, pop, pop them in my mouth. Come on. Emma, please hand me the shotgun. What, you're going to shoot me over them? No, dumbass. Okay, we are going to shoot for them. Nah, dude. Absolutely not. No. Okay, 
There is no way I'm leaving you dillweeds alone with a gun. Come on, look, the shooting range I is like right over I hope this guy dies. There, okay, it'll be fun. Okay, look, I want him to die. You and me, old fashioned shootout. First prize, peanut butter butter pops, all to yourself. Dude, I guess you don't really want them then, huh? Fun, you're on. Yeah, boy! Jacob, hand me that gun now. I mean, nobody's handling any firearms if you're gonna act like a dick about okay, it. Okay, then you can be the ref. We need an objective third party. Okay, we're trying to get a party started here, Jacob. Okay, well, the main party's not gonna die just because you're off on a little side quest. Come on. Please. Did you just load right. it for them? Yeah. Guess we're gonna have ourselves an old fashioned shootout. <sighs> Look, there's a clearing we can use as a shooting range back there, but if I see either of you dicking around, I am turning this car around. Oh, uh, we'll be good. Her face, she's just like, nope. Okay, so just so you know, I was an expert marksman, <clears throat> third class, three years in a row, ranked highest in camp each year. I'm just letting you know that your goose is cooked, Nick, but if you back down now, I might let you just have one little peanut butter butter pop if you're lucky. No way. You've never even seen me shoot. Yeah, that's because you've never shot before. Yeah, not that you know of. <laughs> okay, I think I would know if okay, you're actually- Okay, boys, I'm gonna have to stop you right there. As much as I'm enjoying your charming machismo, the moment we step foot on the shooting range, we're playing by my rules, okay? And what I say goes, got it? Okay, good. Now I'm gonna go set up some targets and get more shells. Do not move a muscle or touch his gun until I'm back. Yeah, I, don't, I wouldn't trust him. Take it with you. All right, so is it just me? Is it kind of hot once you get so bossy like that? I'm always hot, pencil Yeah, deck. okay, thank you. Bye, bye. So, um, how's your little one-on-one -on -one with Abby in the woods? Fun. How was your little one-on-one -on -one with Emma? Oh, dude, it's incredible. She's totally still into me. Really? Yeah. Just gotta figure out this whole long distance thing. Is that what she wants? How would I know what she wants? Well, I mean, you could ask her. <laughs> I could ask. <laughs> That's funny. Speaking of, let me show you how a real man shoots his gun. Are you guys seriously still thumping your chest at each other? No, I think he's got brain damage. <laughs> okay, please just give me the gun. I want him to die. Uh, I want him to die you'll so have bad. It when I say you'll have it. All right, huddle up, boys. This is how we're going to do this. You're shooting the one on the left. Nick first, then Jacob's turn. Keep your fingers off the trigger till you're ready to shoot. You got it? Aye, aye. All right. Two things. Remember the spread. Remember the recoil. This is a shotgun. We're not sharpshooting here. The flashlight shows you where you're aiming. Obvs. All right, Nick, one point. What? Okay, we're too far back to do any real damage. Let's scooch forward a little and uh, fuck these guys up. Thank you, good. Jacob's a good dude. No, he's not. All right, Dick. Nick. This time for real. He's the reason they're here. He literally is the reason they're all gonna die. Nah, I hope he's the first one nice dead. Nice shot. He deserves it. Lucky. Point to you, Nick. Good job, Nick. All right. Let's see what you got. All right. You might want to uh, avert your eyes, Nick. I don't want to give you any more performance Venom. anxiety. I'm totally missing right, the point right. here. Just shut up and shoot, Jacob. I'm totally missing the point. I thought you were an ultra elite pro marksman. Yeah, with like a rifle. Whoa, okay, dude, not with this freaking cannon dude, blaster. That is how you get someone yeah, shot. Yeah, see, fuck this guy. Nah, it's okay. You probably would have missed me anyway. Hey, this guy's terrible. For being a dumbass. What? No. Yeah, I would never hang out with this person ever. Sorry, oh my Jacob. god. Better luck next time. <laughs> Butter luck next time. Hey, I didn't <laughs> want to say it, but you're both very mean.
Blam, we thought this was over. What the, whoa. Pop, pop, peanut butter, butter pops. I do, he's like grade A definition douchebag. Oh my goodness. They wouldn't even be in this situation if he didn't mess with the car. Okay. New idea. Party game. Mm. Uh, Come on, people, we might never see each other after tonight. Let's make some memories. Well, what do you have in mind? How about the ultimate game of secrets and lies, truth or dare, but Dylan style? Okay, house rules are, someone asks you truth or dare, then you choose, and then you do. And there's no ifs, ands, or buts. So like, normal truth or dare? Yes. So we can like, make people kiss? If they choose dare, yeah. As long as everyone consents, of course. Cool beans. I mean, keep it in your pants until it's your turn, but... <laughs> well, who does get to go first? Well, it's house deals, so... Abigail. Truth or dare? Um... Truth. You really dodged a bullet, huh? All right, here goes. Have you ever slept with anyone? Oh, I... Uh, um, I... Hey, take it easy, man. That's too far. Come on. I, I'm not finished. Um, have you ever slept with anyone at this camp? <laughs> no. Nope. Sorry. All right, Abby, it's your turn. <laughs> All right, okay. Um, uh, Abby, oh my God, just pick someone. Okay, okay, um... Ugh. I don't know. Ugh, ding, 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 too late. My turn. Ryan, truth or dare? Truth, I'm an open book. Okay, okay, let's get right down to it. Let's do. You and Mr. Hackett. Here we go. What were you doing in his office? We were talking about her. The hat. Oh, of brother. <laughs> he asked me to stop telling ghost stories. This is all. You don't really believe that, do you? I try to look at things through a certain lens, no expectation or judgment. Look, do I believe there's a little old ghost lady floating around trying to eat people? Well, well um, but she eats people now? But it's kind of fun to imagine it, right? Is it? Just don't get eaten tonight. It, like, really put a damper on the mood. Do my best. All righty, who shall I pick? Well, uh, me and Jacob haven't gotten a turn yet. Good point. All right, Jacob, let's see what you're made of. Oh, there, there, man, come on. Okay. I dare you to take a flying leap over that fire pit. <laughs> Naked. Oh, dude! Fuck yes! Oh, I will jump over this thing. I don't care. Yeah, I don't think that's a good idea. 
No, Jacob, wait. Don't do it. Stop. Dude, I say veto. You're gonna fuck yourself up. What? No, come on. Why is his leg so glossy? Fine, Vito. You know what? Fuck this game. All right. <clears throat> Someone else can go. Okay, fine. Then I call your turn. <clears throat> Whatever. He shaves them. Nice and smooth. Emma. There. Emma, so you have to kiss. Jacob? Or. Oh. Nick. Uh. Well then. Um. Uh, sorry, Nick. This is not uh, even there, obviously. I don't know if that's a good this. idea. I choose Nick. What a bitch! Oh. Poor Abby. Seriously. Guys. Guys! That was more than just a kiss. Thank you, Nick. Yep, I hope She's she dies gonna... now too. She's on my list. You like kissing my girlfriend, asshole? It's not your girlfriend. It was just a game. Hey, I am nobody's <laughs> girlfriend. The fuck it was. It was just a game. Yeah, the fuck it was, man. Jacob, grow up. She knows well, I guess I should exactly probably what she go did. After him. You should probably go find Abby. So, anybody want to play part Jeezy? What? How do they not see them? Fuck this. What? Those, those, they're pretty close. Welcome back. I am, as always, delighted that you're here. So, then, what more has been found? The Hanged Man. <laughs> to be the Hanged Man is to surrender, and by doing so, gain a new perspective. So look carefully and consider that sometimes one needs to be strung up in order to let go. But these are just words. There's more to show you, if you'll let me. That's all I have to say for now. Secrets remain buried and the night grows darker. I'll see you again, you can count on that. Be careful. Where the wolves go, the ravens follow. I didn't really, uh, give me mud.